My name is Keena McMahon, and I was married to Justin Strelzik of the Pittsburgh Steelers, one of the first football players to be diagnosed with CTE. CTE is a progressive brain disease that's caused by the constant blows to the head that most football players obtain during their careers, and Justin was diagnosed with it in early 2000. NFL Sundays don't exist to me anymore. I'm probably, you know, a few people in Pittsburgh, but um, they have a very different meaning, and it's, it's, it's hard because they, I mean, we had such a, a great life on those days. You know, our Sundays were filled with family and friends and college roommates visiting and other um, players' kids coming to our house after games, and we would have Halloween parties and, you know, barbecues outside, and his friends from Maine would come and bring lobster, and, and those were great days, but to, I can't, I can't watch it anymore. I, I, I don't. I, you know, I, it, it doesn't exist. I usually do other things, what anybody does on Sunday, whether it's clean up my house or go running or, you know, take the kids to the, you know, pumpkin patch. It's always fall. I mean, and it's a hard time of year because he died um, the last uh, day of September. So it's always during football season. Um, so, you know, there is that kind of, you know, connection there. But I don't, it's not on my TV unless my husband might have it on. But I don't sit down and watch. <sighs> because to me, I'm just looking at a bunch of guys that are going to die soon. And I think that's what kills me the most is that I have to sit here and watch my friends that are now retired and don't play anymore possibly go through what I had to go through. And there's nothing that they can do but watch the person they love die because that's what's going to happen. There's no cure unless you lock the person in a padded room and keep them away from everybody else. There's nothing you can do. And it's very hard for me to watch because I still have friends that I know that coach or play or somehow connected to the NFL. And usually their husbands have played now that, and they're now coaching. I watch, you know, players that Justin played with are coaches now. Um, some are trained, have went on to college trainers, and I'm just looking at them thinking, I'm going to get a phone call someday from a wife or see in the newspaper that the same thing happened to them. Because, I mean, a very high percentage of the, especially the linemen, and that's who you were closest to. You know, we were closest to other linemen. Um, they're the ones that are going to, deteriorate like Justin did and that's why it's hard for me to watch because I just I feel like I'm just looking at guys that are gonna die I don't feel like it's it's not entertaining to me it's sad and that's like it's I can't I just don't it's hard I can't watch it it's not something I want to do on Sunday